The Florida High School Athletic Association made it official today. High school sports are canceled for the remainder of the academic year with the hope of returning in the fall. The decision made with, quote, heavy hearts, but that the safety of the student athletes, coaches, officials, and fans is our top priority. The decision comes on the heels of Governor DeSantis mandating distance learning for the remainder of the school year. And while Big Ben coaches and athletes understand the decision, it doesn't make the loss of their senior year any easier. I think it's been coming for a while, but it still definitely hurts that my senior season is officially over. I don't get the chance to play with those girls again. I know we had uh, a few seniors that were really looking forward to the season. It's kind of heartbreaking for them. We were hoping we'd still be able to finish the uh, end of the season since we're not going to have any more this year I guess it'll be over. Something that had been suggested by the FHSAA before today's decision was giving seniors an extra year of eligibility to play high school sports. In today's announcement the FHSAA confirmed that after reviewing Florida statutes and FHSAA bylaws there will be no additional eligibility given to student athletes, something that most athletic directors understand. It would in the case of a senior, many seniors, you know, violate you know, the age limit, which is really something that is held to a, a very high standard. I just don't see how it could have possibly happened. It, it's, it's great in theory. Um, again, looking out for those kids that lose a senior season, but the, the practicality and the reality is I don't see how it could have worked. Just a tough day for athletes in the state of Florida. Now in Georgia, the Georgia High School Association canceled sports back on April 2nd. In Tallahassee, Allison Posey, ABC 27.